everyone, it's me, QP83. I have a doll here to show you. I ordered it from AliExpress, honestly, only about like two weeks ago. Um, if not, if two weeks ago, if not less. Uh, and she already arrived, so I wanted to show her off to you because I think she's adorable. So this is a doll I ordered from the AliExpress so store. Wenifs? Uh, I've tried to pronounce this a thousand times before the video. I think it used to be called China BJD. Um, but now it's O-U-E-N-E-I-F-S, and it's on AliExpress. It's one of the more talked about, um, like, BJD recast sellers on AliExpress. Um, so you should be able to find it relatively easily if this is a doll that you are curious about or interested in. So she's 27 centimeters, 1 sixth scale BJD, um, and the title for her, the name for her is Souk Doll. Um, and it says she has a Fen Jian body. I've looked these things up and all I found was this one, so that's all I got for you. <laughs> but honestly, the reason I'm putting this video together is because this um, Shugo Fairy rabbit doll uh, from uh, the AliExpress store is just so cute. She's just so cute. I mean, look at her cute little face. You can't help but be like enchanted by this cute little bunny face. So she was in the AliExpress warehouse, which is why I got her so quickly, meaning they had already done the face up and everything. So this is like the standard face up they would give this doll. She is, um, like I said, quite adorable. And the face up is actually done really well. The blushing that they did on her ears and like the little bits of hair here, um, like her furry little cheeks and her forehead, it's just really, really well done. She has body blushing actually all over her body. You'll see some here with like her knee joints and her leg, her thigh joints and her feet. And uh, I wanted to point out with her feet, she has like three little toes or like little bunny feet. They're not human feet, they're like cute little bunny feet, which does make it impossible for her to stand. So I will need to order her, or I'll need to use a stand for her or have her sit because they are cute little bunny feet, um, which are not very conducive to like standing flat on a table or on a doll shelf. But regardless, it's just too cute. Her body itself is kind of cute, but before I take her outfit off, um, this is the full set that I ordered. So it came with the face up and the outfit, all the things, which I think is the way to go because they're generally really affordable for the full sets if you get them on AliExpress, and then you have to do a little less work right off the bat. I do plan on taking this girl to puddle, so I'm gonna see if there's anything else that might fit her. She has a weird body type though, which you will see in this video, so maybe, hopefully, there's something at puddle. If not, this is a cute little outfit. Um, it is not poorly made. It's a cute outfit, fits the bunny, and I like that she has something to wear right off the bat. So let me take this off. She, this is her, some dolly nudity here. This is her little bunny body. She doesn't have a lot of a bust because she's a bunny, so it's fine. Um, she has a very tiny little waist and then it kind of goes into this very round behind here. She has thicker thighs than some BJDs out there. Um, as you can see here, just little thicker features here. So when I'm buying her outfits, I will have to be cognizant of that because she won't fit like monster high. <laughs> um, but she is so cute. Her arms are pretty much your basic arms. They don't have a lot of like this thickness to them. If you do buy her, this belt on the outfit does have Velcro. You don't want that to get on the lace because that will get caught on the lace, which is not good. So she does have um, hands that are, they're the same on both sides. Obviously there's a left and a right. She does have some paint on the fingernails to make them the same sort of pink that her body blushing is. Um, but her hand mold is actually kind of cute. Her fingers go out a ton. <laughs> like I don't know if that's natural. She's definitely doing some like overextension of her fingers in here but it is kind of a cute little hand. She even has lines on like, the palm of her hand. Like there's like one or two little lines, like she has like a lifeline. Um, 
and some other lines, which is actually interesting because um, generally I don't think I've noticed that. So this adorable little bunny BJD came in this Shugo Fairy box, which from what I read is like the house brand of um, that AliExpress seller. So that's what they call their BJDs. They put them in this cute little box. It did come with a magic eraser. It came with Velcro, which is interesting to me because she doesn't have a wig. So I'm like, what's the Velcro for? Uh, maybe it's if I wanted to wig her, but I feel like wigging her would be hard. Also, do I want to? Because she's so cute without a wig. Um, but it did come with bits of Velcro. You also get your, um, just your care card that tells you fun, uh, fun things to do, keep me dry and clean, um, don't touch the face, keep her out of the sun, all the things that they say to do with BJGs. Uh, and I got a uh, membership voucher, which I have to read into. I think it's some sort of rewards program for this, this seller. But that's basically it. I mean, honestly, there's not much I can say other than the quality of this doll is fantastic. The face up is just so adorable and so well done. Um, and there are people who are probably going to be like, oh, well, it's just a recast, so you shouldn't have it in your collection. But honestly, this is an adorable doll. And I already love it, so it deserves a spot in my collection um, and it's just so the face-up is so well done like that's the thing that really makes BJD's in my opinion sometimes it's it's the face-up right but it's all about the face-up and this has a really really pretty face-up plus I love the sculpt of the head the body and its unique proportions are all, also kind of interesting I like how they kept some of the aspects of the bunny within the body too it's not just a human body with like a bunny head so I do like that. And I love her little feet. It's just so cute. Even if they won't allow her to stand, they're just adorable. So if you would like a doll like this, I will put a link in the description to um, the store I picked it up on. If you Google this, there are other sellers, but like some don't do body blushing. Some are only selling the head. So I'll link to the one that I picked it up from because I had a good experience. So you should too. So let me know your thoughts in the comments and I will talk to you later. Bye.